This might be the quickest pass of day. Yes, it is. 11.55 at 120 miles an hour, that left-hand lane. Holy cow. Man, if that does Virgil quick, clip, uh, quick, geez, easy for me to say, huh? Quick, clipping off, 12.99 with a 9. Great run for that Dodge, 11.55, 120 miles an hour. Man, 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 that is moving.
coming. They're lefty in lane. 1527 for that big machine with sleeper on it. 94 miles an hour. Ready in lane. 22 and a half and only 62. He's got a twin turbo. Yeah, but you're slower, you're only 14594. No, 1459. No. 14, 1454. Oh. Right, so 1455. He was, he was a half a second faster. I know but he has a higher upper end. I, I gotta go up on two. I'm gonna stand by my feet. I, I can't get to a handle faster. Okay. Yeah, no, you gotta be up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
Hurricane Hills. Hurricane Hills, the motocross track off of Clifford. Power stroke down here in the left, spinning tires as it goes on. Let's see who this may be. Matt Kilmo, East Hamilton, New York. That's an 05 at 250, so that is a 6.0 liter in there. 1335 for that 60, almost 99 miles an hour. That's a second year for this body. It's Jerry Parlapiano out of Phillipsburg, New Jersey in his 88. F350 there. Jerry clicks off 1978, 66 miles an hour. Thank you. Over there. Just trying to see what that is. But that's probably in the same year, 87, 88. Chevy 21, almost an half. Left hand lane here is Rich Reddick, 1997. Kenworth. Lighting up all eight of them here. Let's see. Uh, Rich gets himself back into 13, 1350, 1370, and then went uh, 14 and change. Rich trying to get this bobtail down in that thing again. Red light start here. Left hand lane by about 04. A okay though. Doesn't really matter. Look at that Kenworth just. Rip down the track. Looks like a good pass here. What do we got? Nope. 14.23 this time again. 105 miles an hour. Thank you. Yeah, it was. That's right, the hot dog wagon down there. More than just hot dogs. Got all kinds of cool stuff down there. Pulled pork, chicken empanadas. Colleen and I, I got to tell you, up here in the tower, we love them. 
I don't know why I haven't been down to see what Mike's got today, but he's got cold drinks down there, birch beer, root beer, all kinds of good stuff too. French fries, pierogies. Again, head on down and see Hot Jimmy's down there because it is getting to be about lunchtime. down here in the left hand lane 1980 if not mistaken be the first year for the 7.3 and that would be a non turbocharged 7.3 here in the left hand lane right hand lane Chevy over there don't know if that's a diesel or not see no black smoke coming kind of sounds like it could be a gas truck nugget down there blowing all kinds of black smoke thank you Orange Crush, 21 and a half, 59 miles an hour. Clean Cummins down here, left hand lane, pair of stacks in it. That's Josh Rico. Out of my hometown, Strasburg, Pennsylvania. Just across the border over there. 07 Dodge, 1443, no, almost 90 miles an hour there. Hey. Want to find out the 411 here at Island Dragway? Kind of head on over to raindout.com. That's right, R A I N E D O U T.com. Raindout.com. Enter in your. That's right. Email address or your cell phone number, and they will either email you or text you what's going on here at Island Dragway. So again, you're across the border over there in the Poconos, you want to come to Island Dragway. Got some sprinkles happening there, and it's sunny and nice here in good old downtown Great Meadows. You won't know that unless you have raindout.com. We'll text you, again, normal text rates or data do apply. So we text you, we'll text you and let you know if we're running here at Island Dragway or again, it's raining here in Great Meadows and sunny in your neck of the woods. Again, that's raindout.com and in Island Dragway. Put in your email or your phone number. And you find out what the 411 is here at Island Dragway. Don't want to do that? Yes, we are on Twitter. Again, look us up on your Island Dragway. We will send you tweets of what is going on here at Island. And good old FB, you want to find out what the story is on Facebook? Yes, we have Island Dragway pages and plenty, plenty of friends to show you what is going on here. Pictures, all kinds of things. From Island Dragway. So again, many, many types of tools for social media. Find out what the information and what is going on here at Island Dragway for you. Coming up tomorrow, just normal. Test and tune, gambles race, things like that. So if you want to come back, see what's going on here. And this coming Wednesday, as the first Wednesday of every month, is our family night. You got that one, you gonna race again? Yeah, probably one more time. Go ahead and run your car. 30 bucks of a trailer. If you want to 
to bring your car in and run it on a fancy night. That's right, Wednesday. Night. It's funny, that was my slowest time, but uh, luckily I, I ran against somebody that was... Uh, oh, you beat that person? Yeah, I beat that guy. Oh. But luckily, you know, he... Um, because of the lift, and I, I don't know if he has any performance stuff done, but... The other two trucks were twin turbos. I didn't have a stand a chance against the other ones, but oh. this one I did. How do you know they're twin turbos? By the year. By the year? Yeah, the, the, the generation before this one, they had twin turbos in them. It was a different engine. Oh, that's engine. not a modification to the truck. That's how they came? That's how they came, yeah. Oh. You saw it, right? Daddy, yep. why, yeah. you, why, was, why did why the other truck that beat you? Because they were faster trucks. But they, they had more power than me. A lot more power. And when, when we hope Mike got a video in. <laughs> We both, are, I mean, I am just bad at that Jeez. thing. Jeez. <laughs> I'll see you open my car. All right. Are you going to run again? Yeah, I'll do one more time. Should I wait for somebody to run with me, or? No, no, no. Don't, don't be scared. Oh, no, I... I... No, no, no. <laughs> you can go by yourself. All right. Gambler's race here going to happen uh, later on today, somewhere around 3 o'clock. If you want to get bought in for the gambler's race, remember it is a bracket race. That's why everybody should be out here making your test runs so you get your best guess on what your truck's going to run in the bracket race. Again, go over to the SSR. That's Super Show Rigs Tent. $35 for pickup trucks. $50 for big wigs that is the gambler's race can go see josh or his fine staff over at the ssr tent they will get you all signed up and gladly take your money to pay you back some of that later on to the winner again good looking set of show trucks over there across the canal also some vendors hanging out over there with some diesel truck stuff, t-shirt vendors, things like that. So lots going on here today at Island Dragway.